a scary thing? Hey guys, what's happening? Dave Wobble here. Welcome to I.O. All right, so I gotta know from you guys, how old are you guys? I don't really know how old our fans are, so type it down there so I can read it. Now, okay guys, normally I do really high energy stuff, yes, with a lot of hand gestures, but today I've gotta slow it down because this is a very sentimental story about a woman who committed suicide. The woman's name is Rachel Go. She committed suicide on November 1st of 2014. Now, of course, it might seem like old news, but the reason we're talking about it is because they officially declared that her death was a suicide. Now, Rachel's reason for suicide was because she was fast approaching 30. But it wasn't just because she was approaching 30, it's because she was approaching 30 and she wasn't married and she didn't have any kids. And she felt like, you know, she hadn't accomplished what she wanted to do in life, which is a really sad and unfortunate thing. Even though she had a boyfriend for two years whose name is Anton Tesfarev, she had a constant fear that Anton was always going to leave her. And she also suffered from great grief when her mom died in 2000. 11 from cancer. So this girl was going through some hard times. Now things that point to her suicide, she told a therapist that she actually started researching suicide techniques. Along with that, on the morning of her death, she found suspicious texts on her boyfriend's phone, which Anton says she misconstrued. However, she told him to go sleep somewhere else, but when Anton returned later on, he found her dead in front of the fireplace. And guys, when I do these stories, it's really important that I say that the hearts and thoughts here at IO are going out to the family because this is a really sad, unfortunate thing. And it's really tough because we live in a world where, you know, things just, they're tough. But for people out there who are suffering from depression, it's so important that you get out and you talk to somebody. And, you know, because there are people out there listening. So if you guys have something that's bothering you, let us know down in the comments below. Yeah, of course, there's going to be some haters and kids who are going to say some rude and inappropriate things, but just ignore them. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm Dave Wapple, and keep it real, keep it classy, keep it on the flip side. Out there in the real world. Later.